what I am going to add in the cow green. And we're just going to go on and get these greens on in here. This meat anyway. Down at the bottom up under the green. everybody doing today good because what we are doing today first of all you guys how is you really truly doing okay terrific I'll take it so yeah you guys today we're gonna do for Sunday dinner cow greens and smoked turkey yes we're gonna have us some smoked turkey and delicious cow greens you guys if you're ready for this video thumbs it up and come to the channel. And yes, share this video with any and everyone. Let them know what your girl is doing on this channel. Because your girl is going to make her some cow greens and smoked turkey. Yes, we have one smoked turkey wing, I do believe. And we're going to go in. We're going to make us a Sunday dinner with some fresh homemade cornbread. Because that's all I need. I don't need a lot. We don't need a lot. So let me go on and wash this off and get it over in this pot. So that we can get the greens in, you guys. Guys, so to the pot, I am going to add my greens in here. Going to add my greens. These are cow greens. And what I'm doing is getting them out the water. You guys, wait one minute because I want to bring some of that meat up on top. Because I want to bring some of that meat up on top. <clears throat> Let me get down in here and see can I get one. There we go. I should have did that from the beginning. But I wasn't thinking. You know, sometimes cooking, you don't have your thinking cap on sometimes, you know. Yes. I love this fresh scent of greens cooking on a Sunday and it could be any type of green you guys I just love it it just brings out a Sunday to me just brings out a Sunday to me you guys So we're going to let that cook down because when I put the next bundle in, that's when we will put our seasons. Okay guys, so as you can tell, let me move my pot over a little more. It's hot. I have added the last of my greens in here. <clears throat> Excuse me. have to clear my throat. Okay, so. Now, our next move is we're going to season this up to our liking. Now, usually, I go with the green seasoning. And, yes, I am reaching in my cabinet. That's why you don't see me. Okay, I usually go with the green seasoning. But, today, I am going to put my own seasoning that I have put together, you guys. Because I like to enjoy my greens with that particular seasoning. Soon as I get it. Okay. So I have a, a blend seasoning 
that I always use because I like to watch the intake of my saw. So we just gonna go and season that on up. And yeah, you can use whatever blend seasoning you have. And our next step is we're gonna use some oil, veggie oil. You guys, now I have tried olive oil in here. It's much healthier. But we want that southern taste. Okay? We want that southern. And if you could smell this kitchen right now, you will be amazed. And that's pretty much all I am going to add in the cow green. And we're just going to go on and get these greens on in here. This meat anyway. Down at the bottom up under the greens. We already have one down there. Let's get the other one down there. And we're just going to slightly be careful and turn it. And pull from the bottom. That's all. Pull it from the bottom. Bring it to the top. Now this pot that I have, I enjoy cooking greens like that in here, especially when I know that I might be issuing out plates. Because now I have started issuing out plates, you guys, for Sunday dinner, you know, because I cook too much. And as you guys can see, I enjoy cooking. So yeah, your girl, this pot top is hot. Your girl enjoy her cooking. So some Sundays I do give certain plates out. You know, I give them a trail, whatever I cook. So I hope you guys enjoy this little clip on how to make greens. You can make any type of green you want. Mustards mixed with turnips. Uh, mixed greens itself you can make you can make collard greens um, you know it all depends on what type of green you want you can from fry to steam to boil okay and today we have some cow greens the southern way what we grew up on and y'all go check out my other green recipes you definitely would enjoy one or two Hey, maybe a couple of them. It's different ways you can cook greens. So I am going to get ready to close this out because I'm just going to let these do their thing. And I don't want to hold you guys long because that's basically it on the greens. So enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Because meantime, I'm just going to whip up some cornbread. And I'm going to close the video out. So I'll see you in the next clip, okay? So be watching out for my cornbread. Bye. I'll see you in a minute. Okay guys, so we're back. As you see, I am boiling some water because I decided to put some macaroni on. Yeah, yeah, some delicious macaroni and cheese. And I have my cornbread mix, which is, I'm going with Jiffy. So yeah, we're going to go with Jiffy today. And so what we're going to do is we're going to insert our macaroni, which I am going with Bartel, I guess. That's what it is. Barala. Barala. Y'all know what I mean. <laughs> you should know me by now, guys. Each one of my cousins should know me by now. Sometimes I get it right, sometimes I don't. So we're just going to make like a, I ain't going to say a half a box, a little over a half a box. But we got it. So yeah, we're going to go here. And... Let me stir that on up because I'm letting this butter cool a little bit. 
before I get in here, but well, we're gonna get this light stir. Because I need those noodles to go on and cook. So we can have a nice dinner for Sunday dinner. And we're gonna put this mix right on over in here. Oh yeah. Who else enjoys Jiffy? Yeah, I decided to make it a lot easier on me. I like to put the butter in and then give it a little swirl. I hope that's not too much because I never really used that pan to make cornbread in. But we're just going to watch it to make sure it does not overflow. Okay, guys, let me move you back a little bit because you're getting a little foggy. <laughs> so, yeah. So, our macaroni has cooked. I'm just going to put a little Imperial in here. We don't need a lot because our cheese actually makes a lot all itself. So, we're going to put that in there. And we have our mozzarella cheese right here, you guys. And we're going to dump that in here as well. And we have some cheddar. And that's going in here as well. Because that's what type of macaroni your girl's in the mood for. what she's in the mood for and I'm just gonna mix this some up in here I'm gonna let it do a thing for a minute and just melt on its own from the heat for my macaroni get it all stirred up in there because we use the mozzarella today that's what we're using We're going to cover this and let it sit for a quick minute. Okay, so we have let it sit for a minute. Look at there. Oh, look at that cheese in this. I love me a good macaroni cheese. I really do. And I always like to put a different twist so that's some seasoning that I mixed up. We're going to put up some milk in here next. Why? Because it's not going to do nothing but make it juicier. You know, a lot of people like to warm theirs on up. Not your girl. Uh-uh. Because we're going to make our own juices. Just like so. Oh, yeah. I can hear most of you saying, that's not enough. I know it. We're going to get this cheese right on off here. Well, because we pretty much is mixed up and ready for the oven. Put a 
That's the level. to make sure that egg in there is blended. for you guys to see it. Look at there. Hit all four corners. Do a little padding. Cause now I'm finna top with some more cheese. I'm going in with some more cheese you guys. And we're gonna slide this on in the oven till it becomes golden brown. So there you have it guys. This is Sunday's dinner. You guys, we have us some delicious fried pig feet. Yes, some delicious fried pig feet with barbecue sauce. Okay, we have our cornbread over here, which is Jiffy, and we have our greens, which is cow greens, with plenty turkey in it. Yes, we have plenty turkey in it, okay? Yes. So, we also have some delicious macaroni and cheese. Not just any macaroni and cheese. We have the mozzarella cheese up in here. And what we're going to do is go in here. Because your girl like the corner. You guys, look at there. Look at there. First bite for you. So, yes. We have us some delicious macaroni and cheese. Cooked slightly different. So, I am going to send... Let me taste this. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I see a little greens on there. But anywho, I am going to get ready to close this video straight out. Happy Sunday. Enjoy your day. Enjoy your family. And don't forget, hit the subscribe button if you're not already part of the fam. I would love to meet you. Leave a comment below, you guys, and ho hopefully you can enjoy your day and this upcoming week. We all has been blessed with and sending much love from my house to yours. Goodbye.